Imagine a world where fresh water didn't flow from a tap, but instead traveled for miles, sometimes across mountains, just to reach your city. Ancient aqueducts were not merely feats of engineering. They were lifelines meticulously carved into the landscape, vital to the survival and growth of civilizations. The Romans, masters of this craft, constructed arches and channels that snaked over valleys and tunneled through hills, sometimes covering distances exceeding 50 miles. Water moved solely by the power of gravity, calculated with astonishing precision, sometimes with a drop of just a few inches per mile, to maintain a steady, reliable flow. These channels supplied public baths, fountains, and homes, fueling the heartbeat of bustling cities and enabling urban life to flourish. But Rome wasn't alone in this ingenuity. The Persians built kanats, underground tunnels channeling water from distant springs to arid towns, ingeniously protecting water from evaporation. In Peru, the Nazca engineered pukios, spiral wells tapping underground aquifers, demonstrating a deep understanding of hydrology. These creations didn't just quench thirst, they shaped societies by enabling agriculture, hygiene, and complex urban development on a grand scale. Their legacy remains, echoing through the veins of modern infrastructure and reminding us of humanity's timeless quest to harness nature's resources.